A school board has a difficult decision to make on whether to forego tradition and make necessary renovations to a flagship school. News Channel 9's Kelsey Bagwell addresses rumors about Gordon Lee High School. Kelsey. Kim, the buildings that house Gordon Lee High School are 85 years old and, according to the school board, are in need of repair. But the extent of those repairs is a hot button issue in Chickamauga. The city of Chickamauga is rich in tradition and culture, and that includes the Gordon Lee High School campus. My children graduated from there, and my grandchildren, and now I have great grandchildren going there, and uh, it's such a landmark and uh, comfort zone for those of us who have lived here forever. The school opened its doors in 1930 and has seen minimal changes since. A lot of history there. But changes are on the way. Last month, school superintendent Melody Day told faculty. Faculty and staff, the school qualifies for renovations funded by the state. They were given three options, two of which are currently on the table that explore renovations to the current facilities or new construction altogether. Some former students find change hard to grasp and say while renovations may be necessary, it isn't worth compromising a Chickamauga landmark. Update it inside, do what they need to do to bring it up to standards, codes, whatever, and uh, give it a new facelift outside and leave it alone. Other residents support modernization despite the school's role as a landmark. I'm pleased to see that they're talking about doing the main buildings and other buildings there at the school. Um, I think it's long overdue. Community meetings will begin in June to avoid any disruption for students, but a decision won't be made until November. Kim. Kelsey, thank you. And the school board is meeting as we speak, and it is expected they'll set a date for those community meetings tonight.